Runs the scissors, sunny star. Sorry, ma'am. Runs the scissors, sunny star. Runs the scissors, sunny star. Butter, snap, butter, snap, butter, snap, butter, snap. Shoot me, Jerry, a thousand. Shoot me, Jerry, a thousand. Fuck, ZD. This is called Dancing with Myself at Night. <laughs> Winnie Dukes decides to ask Corey. This is going to be at 12 a.m., ma'am. Whenever that day is going to be in the morning, my time. Very soon, though. Winnie Dukes decides to ask Corey for a day to Dancing with the Stars. She insists to going <laughs> with him. She says, so you had a bad day, week, a bad week of nightmares. She had a you had a, or he had. So you had a bad week of bad, of bad, or of nightmares. Let's move on, okay, baby? Pulls him like out, a brother, and sister act. Pulls him away very prayerfully. Slowly, not in a fighting, not in a fighting way, more like pushing, playful way. Um, the phone rings, Cord picks up the phone. It's through the book. Then she says, Corey, why did you leave so early at the party? <laughs> um, man. Um, were, you, were you scared of the boogeyman? She said, boogeyman, like stretched it out. And she just laughs. And she says, okie dokie, Corey. Then her voice changes into a demonic voice. Like that. We almost had our feast with you, but you were fast food. I wanted to taste your blood, and the phone gets kind of connected right there and there. Corey goes with Whitney to dance with the stars with him. The whole crowd looks like a demonic people, red eyes, fangs, even the little children. They, they have the same thing. Rupa, with Ru all of them, I got an illusion. With RuPaul and Tyra Banks, Tyra hugs both Corey and Whitney, says, Oh, so lovely, you little limelight stealers. Oh, our, our, and she says, Oh, he he, and stuff like that. Just kidding. RuPaul hugs them both. Two. Laughs. Normal. How's life, Corey? RuPaul says. Then Frankie J. Grande rolls up to them saying, Hey, hot stuffs. And he's like laughing, ah, like that. Frankie touches Corey's butt. RuPaul kisses Corey's lips. Ty <laughs> no, man. Tyra starts laughing. A flash of darkness comes to Corey's reality. Tyra Banks' laugh turns evil, demonically deranged. Everybody just laughs. Laughing in the crowd is evil sounding. Tyra looks evil looking, says in a demonically deep voice, What's a matter, Corey? Are you not laughing? Hey, everyone. Corey likes drag queens kissing his lips. He loves gay men. He loves gay men. Touching his booty, she's getting more evil looking to the point where this is a short story. To the point where Tyra said, Are you a dancing with the fairies, Corey? Oh, you are a lover of men. <laughs> so sweet, her mouth turns into jaws of teeth like a vampire. I want you, I need your blood. Ecstasy, ecstasy, ecstasy. Get me bloody. Where's Poppy? Where's Smart? Where's Lacey X Facey? Where's Moya? Where's Lena Morgana? Oh, they're the same person. Oh, you're gonna have Tara bites Corey's shoulder, trying to suck Corey's blood. Corey screams, running away, leaving Whitney behind. Whitney looks confused, not knowing what just happened. After Whitney catches up with Corey, takes him to urgent care. A female doctor is the same evil gypsy woman from Drag Me to Hell movie. Plain cut though. Nice looking. 
He says, how long have you been bitten? Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, by this woman. She's like questioning him with question mark. Then she calls men, then she calls men with white coats, ten of them from, from the asylum somewhere. Uh, take them away to Shady Acres. Just ran from my hotel. I say that uh, to get an enema and a stake to the heart. They grab his arms and legs, laughing at them. At them, they took. Oh, and I want the song "Lowly" in the intercom. Uh, drowning pools, let the body sit the floor. <laughs> To look demonic looking. These people look all demonic looking, man. With fangs. The gypsy doctor looks at him with a stake in her hand, saying, with no pupil eyes. Bloodshot eyes, too, with no pupils. Pa pa pointing the stake to his head. Tisk, tisk. Poor Mr. Michael, should the world stop for you? Where's Brittany? Where's where you where you where's your chopped up girlfriend that us at the underworld knows about know what you did now face eternity to damnation she yells out echoes her voice raising the stake to him high then it's over she disappears with the ten men maybe that can never happen he goes home that night, then kisses Whitney and takes a shower like normal. Then loud music plays in his house really early in the morning. Like, I don't know, it's really early now, like at night, like 3 o'clock or 4 o'clock in the morning, 5, 5, yeah, 5 in the morning. And then it, his house turns into a mosh pit all of a sudden with a lot of teenagers and adults moshing, breaking everything in his house. Then that Robert Blake going to be uh, from the side way he's smelling and the mosh pit walk past the sky like and then he disappears smiling like the the guys are like walking past him while he's recording Titanic and, and I want music Fear Factory obsolete playing in his house Divine Heresy face breaker and I want the real and I want the an illusion of the real bands playing the band and music while he's there sleeping on his bed all these monsters and the monsters are just to name a few like random celebrities I want Marilyn Manson I want the gypsy lady from drag me to hell acting crazy it's doing all that I want some people jumping out of his window I want some beer bottles being thrown right next to him not at him and then there's just a whole bunch of crazy stuff and then all the Kardashian sisters and even the Jenners sisters just moshing too and acting crazy and Ariana Grande, uh, Sarah Paulson from American Horror Story, um, just and the crazy clown from American Horror Story freak show at this open face, and a whole bunch of gimps from American Horror Story, even the gimp from a Pulp Fiction over there, like, they're going crazy and everything, and then and it just goes away from that, man. It starts at 12 a.m. in the morning, my time, and, and then I'll talk to you more about this, all right? Um, girls. I hope you're triggered. Celine, Eva, Hannah. Hannah, I would say, oh, Hannah Joy. <laughs> okay, girlfriends. <clears throat> anyway, I'm gonna go. This stuff's almost over. We got, I got like two more. Maybe when you come over, you can help me with the next one. Peace. <laughs>